And we welcome you to the 1972 Stratomatic Game of the Day, June 22nd, 1972. As today, it is the Houston Astros taking on the Cincinnati Reds. When we look at our standings so far, everybody, let's take a look at them. The Houston Astros are 32 and 19. They are three games ahead of the Reds. They're 31 and 24. So this is a big game in the NL West. Both teams are one and two in the division. The Astros playing a surprising first place ball while the Reds are starting to make a little bit of a comeback. They're three games back as we head into the end of June. Lineups are on the screen for the Astros. Metzger at short, followed by Cedeno, Wynn, May, Watson, Raider, Helms, Howard, and then Dave Roberts. For the Reds, Rose at first, Morgan at second, Tolan at center, Bench behind the plate, Perez at first, George Foster gets the start in right, Dennis Menke at third, Dave Concepcion at short, and Wayne Simpson behind the plate. Let's do this at Riverfront Stadium in Cincinnati. As the Reds, and this is going to be super, this is going to be advanced with some super advanced tendencies. Only thing we won't be playing in super advanced will be ballparks and clutch. So here we go. On the mound for the Cincinnati Reds will be Wayne Simpson. So Wayne Simpson on the year has pitched nine innings, given up four earned runs, ten hits, one walk, eight strikeouts. He's 1-0 with an ERA of four. Up first will be Roger Metzger. So Metzger on the year, four for 22, a run scored. Switch hitter Metzger taking on Wayne Simpson, the right-hander. Here's the first pitch. One, three, ground ball to first. Out will be Perez, takes the back himself. And that's the first out. So Metzger is out. That brings up Cesar Cedeno. So Cedeno, the battery, 3 of 16, a run scored in two RBI. Lane Simpson looks in, gets the sign. Here's the pitch. 1-5 for Cedeno, and that is a deep drive to left center field off the top of the wall. Left fielder gets it back in, throws it in his rows, and Cedeno has a stand-up double. So Cedeno's on at second with one out. That was a home run on a one, double two through 20, roll to four. So now here is Jim Wynn. He is five of 22, hitting 227. Simpson from the stretch, runner on second, one out. Here's the first pitch. Three, 10, ground ball to second. Good play by Morgan. Throws him out, and the runner will go to third. So the Astros with a chance. The runner on third and two outs. And it brings up the first baseman, Lee May. He's 2 of 20, two runs scored, has added a home run. The right-hander, Wayne Simpson on the mound, looking at the Reds out of this damage. Here's the pitch to May, 6-4 to righty, and that is going to be a ground ball to third. That is going to be May, that's going to be Menke. Let's see if Menke can make this play or not, first of all. Let's see. Menke is going to be a 2E21. So let's see if he can make this play or not. Here we go. It's an 11 on a 21. So we're going to have to look that one up on a 21. There, ew, there is an 11. That's going to be an error. E5 on Menke, and the run will score. So that will be an unearned run. So reached on first on the error. The error is on Dennis Menke, and the Astros take a 1-0 lead. The first error of the ball game. Let's, there it is. Unearned run perfectly put in. Here's Bob Watson. Watson so far, 3 of 21, 2 runs scored. Astros lead 1-0, runner on first. Simpson from the stretch. Here's the pitch. 1-5 single for Watson. So it keeps the inning alive. Runners will stop at first and second. And the Astros got two on and two outs. Here's the third baseman, Doug Raider. Two on, two outs. Raider, three for 20, a run scored. Simpson trying to pitch his way out of some, out of some problems here. Three, seven, and that is a base hit for Doug Raider. One run will score. Let's see who will score. That will be May will score all the way from second. Watson will go first to third. 
And there you go. The Astros now lead it two to nothing. So both runs are now unearned because the error kept the inning alive. So now here's Tommy Helms. So Wayne Simpson did kind of getting the raw end of things here. Simpson from the stretch. Here's the pitch. 110 is a line drive in the gap or a base hit for Helms. I'll keep the inning alive all right. Watson scores. Raider to third. And the Astros lead 3-0 here in the first. All runs are now unearned. Let's see. Well, actually, kept the inning alive. So we're going to need to make that an unearned run. Let's go ahead and do that. We'll go ahead and switch that over. Here is Larry Howard. So three runs in for Houston, all unearned. First and third, Houston three in. Howard the batter. Howard is 0 for 5. Right-handed hitter. Simpson from the stretch. Here's the pitch. 3-5 and struck him out. Finally, the Astros are done in the first. Three runs, four hits, a huge error by Dennis Menke. We go to the bottom of the first. It's 3-0 Houston. For the Reds, Pete Rose will lead off, followed by Morgan and Tolan against Dave Roberts, the left-hander. So Rose, the batter, he's 6 of 16, four runs scored, including three doubles. Here's the pitch. Three, five, single left field for Rose. So Reds start the first inning. Actually, it's oh, against a lefty. is a base hit, so either way, lefty, righty. So now Rose is on. He's got some speed. So it'll be a minus two, plus one. Howard is a minus one, so it's minus three, minus two on Rose's first number. Fifteen or less. If he can roll a four, he rolls a three. Unable to get established a good lead. Here's Morgan. He's four for 15. Two runs scored. So Morgan up against the left-hander. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Two, nine. Ooh, just missed it. Fly ball center field. That'd be an easier play for Tolan. It makes the catch. Or I say that's a Daniel with the catch for the first out. Here is Bobby Tolan. One out. Runner on first. Tolan on the air. Three of 17. Two runs scored. Hitting 176. Tolan left-handed hitter against the lefty Roberts. Here's the pitch. 3-12. Lefty five ball left field. That will be the left fielder for the Astros. And that is Watson makes the catch. So that is two quick outs. Again, Tolan had a good pitch to swing at. And now here is J.B. Johnny Bench. What a year he had this year. And he loves left-handed pitching. Let's see if maybe Bench can get him close with one swing of the bat. Bench, two for 13, two runs scored. Has a home run. Roberts, the left-hander. Runner on first, two outs. Here's the pitch. 3-10 and a walk to Bench. So Bench kind of gets pitched around a little bit. He is walked. Red's got two on and two outs. And it'll be the first baseman, Tony Perez. Perez, one for 10, two runs scored. Has a... Has a double. Perez looking to get a big hit off Dave Roberts right now. Two on, two out. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch to Perez. 5-3, righty ground ball back to the mound. He is a 4-E-7. This could be interesting to play for him. This is a 6. Let's see if he has it. A 6 on a 4 is a G-3. He gets him. It's a 12 on a 7, and he commits the error. Holy inning for both teams. Roberts fumbled it, could not kick up the play, and the bases are now loaded of reds with two outs. So he keeps the inning alive. Both teams with critical errors in the first inning. So now here is the young right fielder, George Foster. Hits against the lefty, bases loaded, two outs. Roberts from the stretch gets the sign. Here's the pitch, foul ball, strike one. Ooh, don't want to pitch him in the five column. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch, four, three, righty, five ball, right field. Let's see who that'll be. That'll be Win. He's a three e five. Need something high on the 20. That's an 18. Should have been able to avoid the error on that one. Now let's see if he can make the catch. That's an 18 on the threes. An F3. That's a 13 on 
wins five, no error, 14's an error as Wynn just makes the catch. The Reds do not score. They leave the bases loaded at the end of one. Three nothing Houston. We now go to the top of the second inning. The Astros back up again. This time against Wayne Simpson. So now here is Dave Roberts. He's a pitcher's hitting card number seven. Lots of power on the pitcher's card. Could be interesting. Here's a pitch from Simpson. That's a four. That's a 10. Roberts is a lefty. And that's a fly ball right field. Not playing the, the batter. Not playing the ballpark effects. Makes the catch for the first out. So first out for Houston. Brings up the top of the order. Roger Metzger grounded to the first baseman his first time up. He's 0 for 1. Switch hitter. Batting for the left side against Simpson. Simpson with the windup. Here's the pitch. 3, 10, righty ground ball to short. Concepcion comes up, makes the catch for out number two. Here is Cesar Cedeno. Cedeno the batter. Cedeno doubled and scored on the error. Simpson with, with the stretch. With the windup, here's the pitch. 5, 9, ground ball to short. That is Concepcion. He's a 3, E, 26. Let's see if a 3E26 causes difficulty. Let's see. Let's roll the dice. Let's roll the 20 for the range. That's a 14. No problem there. That is a 6, 10, 11 on Concepcion's 26. 26. There's no 11, but there is a 12. So he just barely gets the ball off. Good play by Perez on the scoop. Retires the side. Three up, three down. Go to the Astros. We go to the bottom of the second. Three nothing Houston. So Dennis Menke, Dave Concepcion, and Wayne Simpson. Bat for the Reds in the second. Menke with a big, huge error in the ballgame. He's hitting four for 11, an RBI. Menke, right-handed hitter against Roberts. Here's the pitch. 1-7 against a lefty is a walk. So Menke walks to start the inning. Roberts is a seven-inning fatigue. Simpson is a six. Runner on first, no outs. Here's a shortstop to Venezuelan. Dave Concepcion, right-handed hitter. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch. 3-10, left a single left field Concepcion. They'll hold the runner there. Two on and nobody out. And here come the Reds. So now the doubt is Wayne Simpson. You can see he's putting the bat hat in front for the bunt. He's a C. Here we go. That's a C. That's an 8. An 8 on a bunt. Let's confirm. C on an 8 is a sacrifice, a perfect sacrifice. First baseman gets a throws it to the second baseman, covering for the quick out. So sacrifice hit three to four. Again, that'll be a again that'll be a assist by assist by the first baseman, and then the put out will be made by the second baseman, covering first on the wheel play. So runners at second and third, one out. Here is the left fielder, Pete Rose. Rose singled first, single, but was left stranded at third his last time up. Dave Roberts from the stretch. Rose batting righty against Roberts. Here's the pitch. Six, 11, righty, five ball right field. Perfectly executed by Rose. Win with the catch. That will score the run. It's a sacrifice fly. Minky scores from third, and it is three to one, Houston. So right fielder with the catch, sacrifice fly made. There's two outs, and here is little Joe Morgan. Runner on second and two outs. Morgan, a left-handed hitter against Roberts, a left-handed pitcher. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the, here's the pitch. 6-6, six, six, and he walked him. So Morgan walks, and it keeps the red inning alive. Boy, this is going to be a crazy day. First and second for two outs, and here is the left. The center fielder, Bobby Tolan, he's 0 for 1. Tolan lefty on lefty. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch. 6-6. Six, six. It's a walk again. Same exact thing. Bases loaded of Reds with two outs here in the second. So now the Reds send up J.B. Johnny Bench with all this power. Roberts got to be careful. Bases loaded, two outs. Roberts from the stretch gets the sign. And that's a foul ball. Ooh, probably swung that ball four. 
So Roberts again gets the sign from the stretch. Here's the pitch to bench. Four, eight, righty, just missed it. Five wall center field. The Daniel is there at the track, makes the catch, and the Reds again leave the bases loaded. They score one. We go to the third. 3-1 Houston. Let's look at the statistics to see if we are correct on all this. I believe we are. Let's take a look. Again, Simpson so far. Two innings, four hits, three runs, no earned. That's correct. Six men left on base from the Reds. So all six. Runners left in scoring position. Foster's left two and Bench has left two. So a tough first couple innings for the Reds. They trail 3-1 in the third. Wayne Simpson comes out the pitch to the toy cannon. Jim Wynn. Wynn has ground the second his first time up. Righty on righty. Here's the pitch. 5-8. Ground ball the second. That's Morgan. Morgan's a 2-E-8. It's going to take something crazy to get him in. 17. That's a 12. 12, I believe. Is that again? That's an 8. I don't believe an E8 is going to cause an error on an 8. Let's look. There's no 16 and 17. So good play by Morgan out number 1. So Win has grounded in Morgan twice. And now here is Lee May. Hit, he, get, he grounded out to Menke, which caused the error. And that opened up the floodgates for the Astros in the first inning. Here's May. Here's a pitch by Simpson. Again, that's a 1-7. Oh, struck him out. May was looking for the fences. And this time he caught air. Two outs here in the third. And here is the left fielder, Bob Watson. He singled and scored again. Another unearned run. Simpson gets the sign. Here's the pitch. That's a 3. That's a 7. Stays on the table. Fly ball left field. Rose is there, makes the catch. Three up, three down for Wayne Simpson. We go to the bottom of the third, 3-1 Houston. Now for the Reds, Tony Perez followed by Foster and Menke against Dave Roberts. Roberts gets the sign. Robert Perez reached on an error by the pitcher his first time up. Three, Three, two, lefty, five ball, that deep center field. Back goes to Daniel, makes the catch at the top of the track. Oh, he hit a ride, but Sedano just had enough room. Here is Foster, fly to right his first time up. Simpson gets Dave Roberts with the pitch. Here it is. That's going to be a four, five, righty, ground ball to short. That's going to be Metzger. Metzger is a 222. 222 foul ball. Keep it on the table. There it is. It's a 9. It's a 10. God, I won't even look it up. We'll call that a gimme putt. And there's two outs. So Foster is retired. And now here is Dennis Menke, who committed that big error back in the first inning. He walked and scored. In the red second inning. So Menke to hit against Roberts. Roberts looks in. Gets the sign. 1-6 versus the lefty. Ground ball down the first. Lee May gets it. He kicks it to the bag himself. And that's all for the Reds. We play three. It is 3-1 three, Houston. Top of the fourth. Raider, Helms, and Howard. Against Wayne Simpson here in the fourth. He can work into the six without any control issues. Raiders one for one. Here's the pitch from Simpson. Two, eight, righty is a walk. So Raider walks. And again, they're putting men on base. And now here is Tommy Helms. So Helms the batter. Runner on first and nobody out. What kind of speed, if anything, for Raider? He does not. Mm, 13 first number. Four to five gets the lead. They're not going to hold him. He's not starred. So the Reds have a plus two. Plus probably a bench is a minus four. So it's a minus two on the first number if he wants to try it. Eleven on the first number. Four and five. And he gets the eight. So he's not picked off. He just doesn't get the lead. So now here is second baseman Tommy Helms. Run first. Nobody out. 
Simpson from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Six, eight, righty. That's a base hit. A base hit for Houston. Six, eight, righty. Double one to five. That looks like a six. That's a long single in the gap. Runners will go first and third, and here come the Astros. First and third, nobody else. And now here's Larry Howard, struck out his first time up. Bottom part of this lineup for the Astros against Wayne Simpson. Infield will play in for Howard. Simpson from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Stays on the table. Fair ball. Six. That is a six. Six. Right. He struck him out looking. So Simpson gets the first big K of the ball game. And now here is Dave Roberts. He is that seven hitting pitcher again. We'll see if he can find a good spot in the card again. Infield in for him. Then they're trying to come home on contact. Simpson from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Four, five, lefty, fly ball center field. He got a piece of it. That's a good catch by Tolan. He got it. Makes the catch. It's going to be a sacrifice fly RBI. Raider scores. Helm stops at first. And that's a sacrifice fly in the center field. They're getting the run home. And the Astros add a fourth run here in the fourth. Lead it 4-1 to one with two outs. Good job from Dave Roberts. And now here is Roger Metzger. Metzger's 0 for 2. He's ground the first and ground the short. We'll bat lefty against Simpson. Simpson from the stretch. Here's the pitch. 3-3 three, three righty. Ground ball the first. That's Perez. He'll take it to the bag himself. And that's all for the Astros. Cincinnati, Houston, and we have a problem. Astros score one more. We go to the bottom of the fourth. 4-1 four, Houston. And now the Reds come up in the fourth inning. Concepcion, Simpson, and Rose. The bat for the Reds against Dave Roberts. So Dave Roberts comes in righty against lefty. Roberts sets. Here's the pitch. Six, eight, righty. Ground ball, second base. That will be, let's see, that'll be Helms. He's a 2E19. Let's see if a 2E19 gets the job done or not. That's a 17. That's good. Ooh, a 6 out of 19. We're going to have to look that one up and see what happens. Second base on a ninth. On a 19, there is a 6, and that's an error. So an E4. So Helms commits the error. Runner on first, and nobody out. And now you give the Reds an opportunity as they give an opening. So runner on first, second error of the ball game for Houston. And now here's Wayne Simpson. What do you do here? Down by three in the fourth inning. Again, do you play by the odds and just lay down a bunt? Simpson showing again. The bat head here. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch. That's a six. Again, that is by the... That is a six. Oh, that's defense. Let's see what happens. We know what. They'll take the automatic out instead of trying to find somebody. So Concepcion will automatically go to second. That'll be a sacrifice. Sacrifice hit there. Four again by the first baseman. Another three to four play. Again, we're going to repeat that one. That'll be an assist by the first baseman. And again, that'll be a put out by the second baseman coming off on the wheel play, going second to first. So runner on second, one out. Here is Pete Rose. Rose the hitter. Rose has singled and hit a sacrifice fly. Rose will bat right against Roberts. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch. That's a two. That's a six. Ground ball, second base. He hit it to the right side. Good play by Helms. Throws him out, and the runner will go to third. So they move him 90 feet up. Rose is retired. Two outs here in the fourth. Big opportunities for Reds to answer back. And here is Joe Morgan. He's fly to center and walked. Dave Roberts from the stretch. Runner on third. Two outs. Here's the pitch. 5-6 is a single one to 10. It's a 12. What a play by the first baseman. Lee May. He pitched it to the first baseman. Roberts covering. And he ends it. What a play by Lee May. 1 to 10 single. And he rolled the 12. Reds do not score in the 4th. Let's go to the 5th. 4-1 Houston. 
a game saving play there as Lee May stopped it, picked it up, and pitched it to Roberts covering. And the Reds were done in the four. So we go to fifth. Houston, four runs, five hits, and two errors. While the Reds, one run, two hits, and one error. Top of the fifth coming up. Cesar Cedeno doubled and scored and ground the short. Wayne Simpson looks in, gets the sign. Six, nine, righty, deep drive to left field. Way back, and it is gone. Clear the deck. Here comes a cannonball. Cesar Cedeno and the Astros have taken a 5-1 to one lead. And let's switch it here. Hang on, folks. Messed up here, so I'll we'll go ahead and reset this. Give me one moment to reset this situation again. So set, we'll go ahead and put the zero outs there. And yep, so we go ahead and give him the home run. So there's the home run to Cedeno. Astros lead five to one. That home run came that home run came off Simpson's card. So now here is Jimmy Wynn. Wynn has ground the second twice. Righty against righty against righty. Here's the pitch from Simpson. 5-10 is a ground ball shortstop. That's Concepcion again. He's a 3-E-26. He picks it. Here's the play. That's an 11 out of 26. Is that going to be another error again? Let's see. Does he come up? Does he come up with it? On a 26. Give me a second to find it. Here we go. On a 26. There's no one 11. There's a 12. Throws him out. Good job. Bye. The shortstop Concepcion went away. So the Astros with a 5-1 lead after the leadoff homer by Cesar Cedeno here in the fifth. And here is Big Lee May. Lee has got on an error and scored and struck out. Simpson with the windup. Here's the pitch. 6-2 righty ground ball the first. First baseman is Perez. He's up 3-E-11. Solid both ways. Let's see if Perez comes up with the play. That's a 19. Ooh, that's a 6 on an 11. Again, let's take a look at it. There's a 6, and it's an error on the first baseman. Holy errors in this ball game. This time it's an error on Perez, and that's an E3. So the Astros are playing, playing definitely tricks today. Both teams with two errors. Run on first, one out, one in. Here is Bob Watson. Watson so far has singled and scored and fly to the left. Simpson from the stretch. Here's the pitch. 1-11. Ground ball back to the mound. He gets it. He turns around, gets the fielder's choice on a 1-6. So he gets the leadoff runner out. There is two outs now, and here is Doug Rader. Raider has singled a run and walked and scored. Raider against Simpson. Simpson from the stretch. Here's the pitch. 5-11 to a right. He's a single to right field. And there's going to be, let's see if they'll take the advancement here. Single to right field means Watson is going to be a 1-11. He was not held. That's a 1-12, 1-13. Right fielder for the Reds is Foster. Foster is a minus one, so it's a one to 12. And they will hold them at second. So let's go ahead and hold them at second. First and second, two outs. The Astros trying to get some late runs across. Here's Helms. He's two for two in the ballgame. RBI single and a single in the fourth. Astros trying to put this one away. Simpson from the stretch gets the sign. 4-4, four, four, righty catch, X. But that is bench. Let's see. He's a 1-E-2. Let's see if he comes up with this one or not. It's a 3. Maybe not. Could be a wild pitch or pop-up. It's not going to be anything on a 12, though. Let's see here. So it's going to be an 8-12. No error. It's going to be a three on, it's going to be a three on a one. It's a wild pitch, wild pitch or grounder. So now let's see what the wild pitch results is going to be on Wayne Simpson. 
Wild pitch is a 10. Here it is. That's a one. It's a wild pitch. Runners will go second and third. And now I'll keep the bat alive. So second and third, two outs for Helms. So Simpson struggling a bit here from the stretch. Second and third, two outs. Here's the pitch. Rolls around. Could be trouble. Four, eight, single on the floor. It's a two. Wayne Simpson bitten by a one to four single. Watson scores. Raider to third. And the Astros lead it six to one. So Helms with an RBI base hit. He has three hits in the ball game. And now here's Larry Howard. The reason, ooh, and they may have to get him out of there. Let's see. Simpson from the stretch gets the sign here. Four, six, righty, ground ball to third. Picked up by third baseman. That is going to be Menke. Throws him out. Ends the inning. Holy cow. All runners hold, makes the play, but the Astros add two more in the fifth. They lead it by five, six to one. So now the Reds come up, Tolan, Bench, and Perez against Dave Roberts, up by five here in the fifth. Roberts with the windup, Tolan 0 for 1 with a walk. Two, eight, lefties, a single for Bobby Tolan. So the Reds start off quick. Dow is his first hit of the ball game. Tolan super fast, but probably not going to test him here. Not when you're down by five. Here is Bench. Walked and fly to center. Big opportunity for JB to get him back in this ball game. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Two eight struck bench out. So Dave Roberts got the got the curveball away. Made bench chase. That's one away. And now here is Tony Perez. Perez in the ball game has reached on an error and fly to center. Righty lefty matchup. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Two, six, single on the nine. Just gets it through for a base hit on the nine. He gets it past the second baseman for a base hit. Runners will stop first and second, and here come the Reds. Two on and one out. And now here's the young George Foster. 0 for 2 in the ball game. Righty lefty matchup. Roberts from the stretch. Yes, the sign. One, six, double one, the two. No, nice play by the center fielder, Cedeno. Running catch for the second out. So there's two outs here in the fifth. And now here is Dennis Menke. Two on, two outs. Big opportunity for the Reds to do something. Walked and scored. He unassisted the first baseman. Roberts from the stretch. Two on, two outs. Here's the pitch. 3-10 lefty ground ball down the first. That is pick, picked up by the first baseman. May takes it by himself and ends the inning. Oh, another two more runners left on base. We play five. It's still 6-1 Houston. And the Reds will send up Simpson next inning, which means they'll let Simpson through get past the sixth inning, assuming he doesn't fatigue right now. Here's Dave Roberts. He's 0 for 1 with a sacrifice fly. Here's the pitch. 4 3 lefty. Oh, Simpson. That could be deep. Let's see. Does he get a hold of one? He's a power end to a lefty. Pitcher has just had a home run. Clear the deck. Here comes the cannonball for the opposing pitcher, Dave Roberts. So, Dave Roberts, the opposing pitcher, goes deep. Hits an end home run shot off Simpson's car, and he was an end. So now it's seven to one Astros, and here is Roger Metzger. So Simpson stays in the ball game because he comes up in next inning in the second batter. One ten fly ball right field. One ten ground ball shortstop actually. Concepcion makes the play for the first out. Astros lead 7-1. This is the fourth inning they've least scored a run in. Here's Cedeno. He has doubled and scored, ground the short, and hit a long home run. Simpson looks in, gets a sign. Here's the pitch. 3-12, righty, single, one to 16. That's a 13 for a base hit. So Cedeno with another base hit, number 10 for the Strohs. And here is Jimmy Wynn, the cannon. Ground the second twice. Ground the short. He's 0 for 3. 
Sampson from the stretch gets the sign. Six, four, righty ground ball to third. Again, that is Menke. 221. Let's see if he can turn a double play on this and get out of it. Here we go. It's a four. 21. Oh, he's not going to get a double play on it. It's going to be a six on a three. That's a G3. So no double play on it. It's a four on a 21. I believe we sent four on a 21. There's no error. And it'll be. A ground ball C. Let's see. So four to three. Runners will advance. Only play to first. So runner on second and two outs. Here is Lee May. May against Simpson. Again, Simpson trying to get out of the inning. And then they'll take him out to start the seventh. Here's the pitch. Five, seven. Right single. Right field. I'll send the runner to third. They will try to score him. To Daniel stops at third, two on and two outs. So now here's Bob Watson. He's one for three, two runs scored, including including sing, singled in the first and then hit into a fielder's choice in the fifth. Watson up against Simpson. Simpson from the stretch. Six, seven, righty ground, ball that's short. That's a fielder's choice. Comes up and pitches it to the second baseman. Six to four and ends the inning. So the Astros score one more. We play five and a half. It's seven, one Houston. So now the Reds will send up Concepcion, pinch hitter for Simpson, and Pete Rose. So now here's Concepcion against Roberts. Six run lead. Astros seven runs, 11 hits, and two errors. Reds one run, four hits, and two errors. One, seven, ground ball the second. That's an easy play for the second baseman. Throws him out in a hurry. Nicely job by Tommy Helms, a former Red. Here is Wayne Simpson. He'll be pinch hit for. So let's see. Who will bat for the Reds here? Boy, the Reds just came up and totally snuffed them out. Let's see if the saw had a Bourbon outside here. So probably Pedro Bourbon will probably come in. And then for hitting sake, how about we bring in a, oh, I guess a lefty. That could be the an issue here. Let's see, who do they have? Oh, all that power versus a lefty. Probably not. And might be Cheney. Let's see. And, ooh, nothing against a lefty either. Ooh, now you look. You know what? Joe Haig will get a turn. So Haig will get the shot. So here comes Joe Haig. No men on. So no, one out, no men on. Pinch hitter will be Haig. Haig the batter. Left-handed hitter. Lefty on lefty. Roberts with the wind up. Here's the pitch. Five, six, lefty, single one. The ten, it's an eight. Base hit for Haig. So Haig gets a base hit. And again, his hop back continues to shine. And now here's Pete Rose. Rose is one for two, single and a sacrifice fly. Here's a pitch from Roberts. Six, six, righty, double play ball. Oh no, that's a single and two stars. So Rose a single and two stars. That will get Haig the third. And here come the Reds. First and third and one out. So Rose with his second of the ball game. He's two for four. And now here's little Joe Morgan. He's 0 for two in the walk. Left-handed hitter against a lefty pitcher. Roberts from the stretch. Remember, he is a fatigue seven, so he's still fine. Till the next inning, five, seven, a walk, and the bases are loaded. Here come the Reds. Bases loaded. One man out, down by six, and here is Bobby Tolan. So Tolan's one for two with a single. Left-handed hitter against Roberts. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch. That rolls around for a minute. 
three six is a grit of ball the first picked up by may goes to short to metzger back to first double play three six three and the reds fail the score so we go to the seventh seven one houston so we'll need a new pitcher and it will be pedro barbone here in the seventh inning Wow, double play ball, and you absolutely could not get need one. So we now go to the seventh. Let's go ahead and change pitchers here. So new pitcher for the Reds, and it will be crafty Pedro Borbone. Stays in a nice spot. Borbone on the 72 season, 8 and 3, 3.17 ERA, right handed pitcher. Heel pitching at Raider, Helms, and Howard. Let's go ahead and make that move. So here's Raider. We now go to the top of the seventh, seven one Houston. For Bone with the windup. Here's the pitch. Six. That's uh, a six. Eight righty. It's a shot down the line for a long single. So first hit of the ball game off for Bone is by Raider. Raider's three for three of the walk. What an outstanding job by Doug Raider. Here is Tommy Helms. He's three for three. Right-handed hitter against for Bone. Barbone working from the stretch. Here we go. 5-3 righty. Ground ball the first. That's Perez. He's up 3-E-11. Let's see if he can turn 2 on it. He roll high. Should be able to get 2. A 12 on a 1. That's a 12 on a 3. It's a G-2. It's a fielder's choice. It's a 9 on an 11. And there's no error on the play. So he goes 3-6 on the fielder's choice. So 3-6 on the fielder's choice on Helms. And now it's back to Larry Howard's turn. So runner on first and one out. Howard has struck out twice and ground the third. For Bone from the stretch. Here's the pitch. 3-9. Righty struck him out. Howard down on strikes. And that's out number two. And here he is, the man of the hour. And it's going to be... Dave Roberts, Homer his last time up. He hits against Borbone. Borbone looks in, gets the sign. 3-6 is a ground ball to third. Picked up by Minky. It picks, throws him out. Got him. Good job by the third baseman Minky and ends the inning. Give me one second. Minky with the play. 5-3. And finally the Astros do not score. In their share of the seventh. Let's go to the bottom of the seventh. It's 7-1 seven Houston. So now Roberts in his point of weakness setting. He will pitch to bench Perez and Foster. The bench Perez and Foster against the left-handed Roberts. Roberts looks in, gets the sign. 5-12, ground ball to first base. Again, that's going to be May. He's a 3-E-6. 3E6, does he make the play? It's a 6. 6 on a 3. Should be able to make this. It's 1. He gets to it. It's a 10 on a 6. And there's no error. And gets to the bag in time. 3 unassisted. So 3 unassisted there. So bench retired. Here's Tony Perez. 1 for 3. Single back in the 5th. Right-handed hitter Perez against Roberts. Roberts looks in. Here's the sign. 6-4. Righty. Five ball center field. Valdi Cedeno. 1-E-8. No one on base. That's an automatic out. Let's see if he gets a void. The error. That's a 5. He makes the catch. That's a rare play. Nobody on. It's an out for the second out of the ball game. So two outs. Now for the Reds, it's going to be Foster. He's 0 for 3. So Foster kind of shut out during his work today. Roberts looks in and gets the sign. Here's the pitch. 6, 3, righty, fly ball, left field. Left fielder, 4. The Astros is Watson, 4. He is a 4E5. Can he keep the inning alive? Let's see. That's a seven. That will drop in for a base hit. Seven on a four is a single two. 
And then, ooh, a 16 on a 5 does not make the error. So Watson lets it drop in for a base hit with two outs. And now brings up and it now brings up Dennis Minky. The Reds keep their offense on the field. Two outs, runner on first. Base hit number seven for the Reds. Minky right-handed hitter against Roberts. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Three, six, lefty pop the first. Pop the first. Good play by the first baseman. May makes the catch. And we played seven in Houston, and we played seven in Riverfront. It's seven one favor of the Astros. So top of the eighth coming up. Let's see here in the eighth inning. Houston will now send up Metzger, Cedeno, and Win to hit against Pedro Borbone. Astros seven runs, twelve hits, two errors. The Reds one run, seven hits, and two errors. Here it is, six, seven, lefty, ground ball, second base. Again, that's Morgan. He's a 2E8. Can he not make the error? That's a seven. He makes it 11 on an eight. I'm 99% sure that is a good play on an eight. There's no 11. Nicely done. Four to three. One out here. So one out here as Metzger's retired. Here's Cesar Cedeno. Two, three for four. He's a triple from the cycle. Double and score in the first. Homeward in the fifth. Single in the sixth. Cedeno, the hit against Barbon. Barbon's pitch. Three, eight. It's a strikeout for Cedeno. He's trying a little too hard. Two outs in the eighth. Here's Jim Wynn. Win the ball game 0 for 4. Boy, he can use the reverse bar of this and get a base hit. Borbone looks in the 8th. Here's the pitch. 5 6. Ground ball, third base. Nice, easy hop to the third baseman. Mickey makes the play. So we go to the bottom of the 8th inning. It's still 7 1 Houston. So now for. The Reds will be Concepcion, pinch hitter for Borbone, and Rose. Against Dave Roberts, staying in this game. He's only given up seven hits. He's in his point of weakness inning, plus one. Here's the pitch. Three, four to a lefty, ground ball the third. Nicely hopped by Menke, throws him out for out number one. So now will be a pinch hitter for Pedro Borbon. So now Borbone will come in and will come, off, come out of the game. And now it will be, let's see, against, against a lefty. Let's bring in backup catcher Bill Plummer. So Bill Plummer will be the new pinch hitter. And he's in the game there. Put Plummer. Reverse him there. And he's in. So Plummer's in the game. He's, he's been up one time. So Dave Roberts looks in. Here's the pitch. Six, five, righty ground ball to the shortstop. Good play by Metzger. Throws him out, and there's two outs. So now be the top of the lineup for Pete Edward Rose. So here we go. Rose to hitter against Roberts. Righty versus lefty. 5-8, and that's a line drive base hit in the gap. So Rose will get a base hit, holds the helmet on as he turns first. Rose with his third hit of the ball game, and he's three for four. So Rose on base, last of the eighth, down by six. And here is Morgan. Lefty on lefty matchup. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Six, two, lefty single, one to ten. 19, line drive, second base. Good job, Tommy Helms. So we played eight at 7-1 Houston. Hopefully I did that correct. And now let's go into the top of the ninth. See what made a change. The Reds will need a new pitcher. They batted for, they batted for Bourbon. Lefty, lefty, righty, righty. So kind of a tough situation. They'll bring in Clay Carroll. Carroll will come in kind of their, their closer on this team. 
So let's see some new, let's see, new opposing pitcher. It'll be Clay Carroll staying in a nice spot. And here we go. So Clay Carroll on the mound, top of the ninth. Houston, seven runs, 12 hits, two errors. The Reds, one run, eight hits, and two errors. Here is Lee May. He'll be followed by Watson and Raider. Carroll looks in, gets the sign. Oh, wait, what inning are we in? Sorry, Houston. Yeah. May comes up. That's a 3 3 8 righty and draws the lead off walk. So he gets the walk. So now here is Bob Watson, who's, who is one for four. So Watson, righty on righty matchup. Arrow from the stretch, two, nine, strike Watson out for out number one. So Watson down on strikes. And now here is Doug Raider. Raiders three for three, including a walk and a run scored. Cow from the stretch. Here's the pitch. That's a 6-5 righty. That's a base hit. That's a single in the gap. That will get runners first and third. Nicely done for the Reds as they have first and third lined up. That was a base hit for Raider. And now it's his fourth hit. And now here's Tommy Helms. First and third. One out. Infield will play in. Helms the batter against Carroll. Carroll from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Six, five. There's a base hit off Clay Carroll. It's Tommy Helms. Redo the merry-go-round. May scores. Raider to third. And it is eight to one favor of the Astros. So Tommy Helms, an RBI, his third RBI of the ball game. And now here's Larry Howard. First and third, one out by seven. Howard to hit against Carroll. Here's the pitch. That is a three, ten, ground ball to third. They'll come home. They'll get him on the fielder's choice. Five, two. So the runners will stay at first and second. And now here's Dave Roberts now. Roberts the batter. Roberts against Carroll. 8-1 Houston. 5-7. Left a base hit. And that's a long single. So another hit for the pitcher spot. Dave Roberts. Helms will score. Power to third. RBI for Dave Roberts. And it is now 9-1 Houston. So now back to the top of the lineup for Roger Metzger. He's 0 for 5. Being skunked today. Carroll from the stretch. Two in, two out, two on. Five, ten to a lefty. Ground ball to third. That will be Menke again. Let's see if he's able to make the play here. Menke is a 221 on the, on the range check. Let's see if he's able to make it. It's an 18. He's got it. Uh oh. It's a 12 on a 21. We've had that uh-oh before. No, an 11 is the error. So nice play on the fielder's choice. 5-4 and ends the inning. But the Astros get two more in the ninth. We go to the bottom of the ninth. It's 9-1 Houston. As Dave Roberts will go for the complete game. He can do that with a 7 fatigue. He can go two plus innings without any problems. So Tolan, Bench, and Perez. Roberts looks in, gets the sign. One, nine, lefty, line drive in the gap. No one will get that one. Tolan will have a triple, and he's in there. So leadoff triple for Bobby Tolan. He is now two for four. So the Reds got something going, and here is Johnny Bench. So now Bench to hit her against Roberts. Infield will play back. Again, got to be careful now to fatigue. 5-8 righty. There's another base hit. Now go all the way to the ball. Bitch will have a back-to-back -back triples. And it's a 9-2 ball game. So the Reds claw back. That's their 10th hit of the ball game. Back-to-back -back triples, including Johnny Bench's 
uh, no out triple of his own. Bench with two triples in 72. Just found one. So now here is Tony Perez. Perez the hitter. One more hit will probably fatigue him. Roberts from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Four, seven, struck him out. Good thing. And that would have been a dot for the hit. So one away. Perez retired. One out. Runner on third. For Foster. Foster's one for four. Roberts from the stretch. Runner on third. One out. Infield playing back. One, four, deep drive left field. That's trouble. Gone. Clear the deck. Here comes a cannonball for George Foster. And the Reds are in this ball game. Let's see if we can change that result again. Hang on. Oh, let's see. Let's see if we can. Let's see if we can do this. And there it is. It's a two-run homer. And it is now nine to four. Let's see if we can get him. To, let's see if we can score him right now. Let's, let's see. First, second, third scored. We'll get him the score. And then the home and then the home run. We'll get him the, we'll get him the score plus two RBIs. So go ahead and increase RBI count there. And then we'll increase RBI count there too. So that's two. And then he'll be able to score his own run. He is. And now it's nine to four as there's one out here. So Foster with the home run. Here is Menke. So that will automatically finish Dave Roberts out who cannot finish what he started. So he's gone eight in the third. And now they'll bring on, I believe, their, one of their closers, Jimmy Ray. Who had eight saves during the year, 4.28 ERA. He came in the game and pitched the actual long game in history. So he'll come in with a lead and see if he can hold on to it. So opposing new pitcher for the Astros, it's going to be Jimmy Ray. So there's Jimmy Ray. He'll stay. He stays in a nice spot and comes in the game. So that fatigued him out. It was a it was a it was a triple triple strikeout. Two run homer, and now here is Mankey. Mankey against Jimmy Ray, the right hander. May from the windup, it's going to be a two, a ground ball back to the mound. There is two outs, makes the play. So two big outs. So now here's Dave Concepcion. So with two outs, Concepcion so far in the ball game is one for four the single. Ray looks in, gets the sign. Can this finally finish it? Is this ball game going to be over? One eight, it is ground ball to short. Metzger's got it, throws it in. That's the ball game. So the the Reds get three in the ninth, but it was not enough. The final score: Houston nine and Cincinnati four. Let's go ahead and do an end game. Winning pitcher will be will be Simpson. Actually, no. Winning pitcher is Roberts. There's no save. The losing pitcher is Simpson. And again, this game was played on Thursday the 22nd at Riverfront. Go ahead and give you those statistics. And we'll get you done for the night. Thank you folks for coming out, of course, on this upload for the night. So the winning team is the Red, the Astros. They win at 9-4. Astros scored three in the first, never looked back. Red scored one in the second while the Astros kept scoring. One in the fourth, two in the fifth, one in the sixth. Led 7-1, then led 9-1 with a two-run ninth. Reds added three, not enough. It was 9-4 Houston. Houston, nine runs, 15 hits, two errors. The Reds, four runs, 11 hits, and two errors. Fielding errors were by Helms. Roberts bench Menke with a huge error left on base Astros 10 Reds 13 doubles by Cedeno triples by bench and Tolan homers by Cedeno Roberts and Foster RBIs by Cedeno he had an RBI to make him give him three Helms three RBIs give him seven Raider one Roberts with three RBIs bench with his third 
Foster with two RBIs, Rose with three. Winning pitcher is Roberts, eight and a third, 11 hits, four runs all earned, five walks, two strikeouts. Ray went two thirds an inning. Simpson lost it, five innings, eight hits, five runs, only two earned, one walk, three strikeouts. Bourbon went a nice two innings, one hit, two strikeouts. Carroll, one inning, three hits, two runs, two earned. That really was a big factor toward the end. Final score, Astros win it 9-4, out hitting the Reds 15-11, as the Astros gain another game on the Reds here in the National League West. Thank you, folks, for coming in. Appreciate your time. Again, this has been a presentation of the Sports Time Machine. Final score is Astros 9 and Reds 4.